In the heart of the African savanna, where the sun rose with fiery brilliance and the wind whispered secrets through the tall grass, a lioness named Sarabi gave birth to a cub destined for greatness. As the golden sunlight bathed the pride lands, Mafasa, the noble king of the pride, stood proudly beside his mate, gazing down at their newborn son with eyes filled with pride and hope. Thus Simba, the future ruler of the pride, entered the world, his birth heralding the dawn of a new era.as Simba grew, he reveled in the joy and wonder of the savanna, surrounded by the love and guidance of his parents and the other members of the pride. Under the watchful eye of Mufasa, Simba learned the ways of the pride, the art of hunting, the importance of leadership, and the sacred bond that united them all. Alongside his best friend, Nala, Simba embarked on countless adventures, each one deepening his connection to the land and strengthening his resolve to one day follow in his father's pawprints. As Simba matured into a young lion, Mufasa began to impart to him the wisdom and responsibilities of leadership. Together, they patrolled the borders of the Pride Lands, ensuring the safety of their territory and the well-being of their subjects. Mufasa taught Simba the importance of fairness, compassion, and strength, instilling in him a sense of pride and honor that would guide him throughout his life. But with the joys of leadership also came the weight of responsibility, and Simba soon realized that being king meant more than just wearing a crown, it meant putting the needs of others before his own and making sacrifices for the greater good. However, as Simba approached adulthood, a dark shadow fell across the Pride Lands, a shadow cast by the envious gaze of Scar, Mufasa's treacherous brother. Scar harbored a deep resentment towards Simba, fueled by his own desire for power and recognition. Cunning and manipulative, Scar plotted to seize control of the Pride Lands for himself, even if it meant betraying his own family. With lies and deceit, Scar lured Simba into a trap, leading to a tragic confrontation that would change the course of Simba's destiny forever. In the aftermath of Scar's betrayal, Simba found himself cast out from the Pride Lands, his heart heavy with grief and guilt. Alone and adrift in the vast wilderness, Simba struggled to come to terms with his past and find his place in the world. Haunted by memories of his father's death and his own perceived failure, Simba wandered aimlessly, his spirit broken and his faith shattered. But even in the darkest of times, there remained a flicker of hope, a spark of resilience that refused to be extinguished. With the help of unexpected allies, a wise old baboon named Rafiki, a quirky meerkat named Taiman, and a lovable warthog named Pumba, Simba embarked on a journey of self-discovery and redemption confronting his fears and embracing his true destiny as the rightful king of the Pride Lands. As Simba's confidence and courage grew, so too did his determination to reclaim his rightful place as king. With his newfound allies by his side, Simba embarked on a perilous journey back to the Pride Lands, ready to confront Scar and restore balance to the circle of life. Along the way, he encountered old friends and new challenges, each one testing his resolve and strengthening his resolve to succeed. With the support of his loyal subjects and the memory of his father's love guiding him, Simba faced Scar in a final showdown that would determine the fate of the Pride Lands once and for all. In the end, it was not just Simba's strength or courage that ensured the Pride Lands' survival, it was his unwavering commitment to the principles of pride and honor that had been instilled in him from birth. With Scar defeated and peace restored to the savanna, Simba ascended to the throne as the rightful king, his reign marked by compassion, wisdom, and a fierce determination to protect all creatures, great and small. Under his rule, the Pride Lands flourished, their legacy of pride and honor enduring for generations to come. As the years passed and new generations were born, the legacy of Simba and his pride lived on in the hearts of all who called the savanna home. From the smallest meerkat to the mightiest elephant, each creature played a part in the never-ending cycle of life, their destinies intertwined with the land they called home. And though the sun would eventually set on Simba's reign, his spirit would live on in the hearts of his descendants, guiding them through the trials and triumphs that awaited them on their own journey through the circle of life.